Spencer Price redshirt junior relief pitcher Spencer Price may have taken the loss in Mississippi State's intra-squad game Saturday, but his mere presence on the duty Noble Field mound was reason enough for any Diamond Dog fan to smile. Price was the team's closer in 2017, he finished the year 4-1 with a 2.91 earned run average and converted 14 saves, second most in school history and the most since Jonathan Holder had 21 in 2013. The 6-2, 228-pounder from Olive Branch, hurled a season-long three innings to earn the win in his team's regional tournament championship at Southern Mississippi. Unfortunately, the former junior college transfer suffered an elbow injury in the offseason and underwent Tommy John surgery. Price's appearance Saturday was his first against some form of competition since that 17 season, so, the fact he ended up on the wrong side of 4-3 setback, largely through no fault of his own, mattered little, in fact. Price struck out the first batter he faced and may have departed unscathed if not for a dropped fly ball in the outfield, in the end, Gunnar Halter delivered Luke Hancock with the game winner on a sacrifice fly. Price's presence may have been the highlight, but it was not the only bright light during the 7-plus inning scrimmage. Elijah McNamee put his black squad on the board in the top of the first, slugging a two-run home run off freshman starter JT Ginn. It was McNamee's second homer in just five games this spring. The Maroon team tied the game in its half of the fourth. Marshall Gilbert singled to left and Hunter Blaylock walked with one out. Tucker Childers singled home Gilbert, and Blaylock scored on a ground out. The Maroons jumped on top 3-2 when Gilbert doubled down the right field line and scored on a double play grounder. Infield error and pass ball put the black team in position for its game-tying run in the seventh. Jordan Westberg singled between short and third to account for that tally. It was Westberg's third hit on the day. Lost in the price appearance and the offensive heroics of Westberg and McNamee were the pitching performances of redshirt junior right-hander Tyler Spring and the relief work turned in by freshman Brandon Smith, Springwind. Three innings, allowing just one hit, as the Blacks starting pitcher, he has now allowed just one earned run in five spring scrimmage innings, it was Smith's second straight two-inning stint of scoreless relief. MSU outfielders turned in highlight reel catches during the scrimmage. Bossy L. Williams robbed Landon Jordan of an extra base hit with an over-the-shoulder, back to the infield catch in dead center field in the first inning. Rowdy Jordan stole an extra base hit from Hayden Jones with a running grab toward the left field line in the fifth. State will scrimmage again Sunday morning.